It's 535. I'm going to call the city council into session. Uh, we have a special event tonight, and so I just, uh, we have a quorum. And so before we get to the agenda, though, I want to read something to you. I want to recognize somebody. Let me get it. Here it is. This Friday, Mary Ellen Fullenweider, who lives at Laurel Glen, will be 101 years old. So if you know her, if you go down there, please say something to her and congratulate her. That's a, that's 101 years. That's a lot longer than I've lived. So congratulations to her. I just want to make mention of that tonight. We're going to, I'm going to send her a postcard uh, tomorrow. All right, our agenda is going to call us to order, and our we have one agenda item, and I'm going to call on uh, Monica to come give us an explanation of where we are, and I, we'll see if this is a short meeting or not. So tonight <coughs> um, we have to have a public hearing and the adoption, a vote to adopt our tax rate. We have proposed um, the uh, 44... Uh, 0 0.4420 cents per $100 valuation for our, our tax rate for the tax year 2021. For our, that is split into two sections. Our maintenance and operations rate is 0 0.4245 per 100. And then for the payment of our principal and interest on our bonds, it's 0 0.0175 um, cents per, per thousand. Um, we have the ordinance that, that will be adopted and we have specific language that has to, to be approved. Um, if there, there's any questions, I can answer them. Questions for Monica? It's been a long project for a long time. It, it has. Especially all COVID and everybody else in the state of Texas being late and stuff. Any questions for Monica? So, so just for clarification for people that are going to be asking, the proposed rate although the motion whatever that is is not going to read this way the rate is it's actually a reduction of 1.3 cents in the in the rate correct? right because we for the 2020 year we were at 45 and a half cents per 100 valuation what the state makes us do though because you have the no new revenue rate which is the rate at which um, we would get the exact same tax levy um, from the same properties in, in 2020 that were on the tax roll in 2020 and it takes into the production loss and things but it doesn't take into consideration the new property that was added in so we, we get that as extra but that no new revenue rate um, for this year was 0 0.4339 per 100 so that's why uh, as far as the rate change they they make us approve uh, have the language it's based on the percentage change from the no new revenue rate this year to the rate we're adopting this year mm -hmm. so the that would be 1.87 percent increase and then and our m and o which is the information that we have on the ordinance the the information <coughs> it is based strictly on the M and O, so that's why you see different percentages and different amounts. Because in some places we recognize the total tax rate, and in some places we're just looking at the M and O piece of it. Not debt service. What was yeah. the what was the total of new uh, new build revenue? It was I have that in the budget. It's about fifty eight thousand was the the new and, and total tax rate uh, additional taxes was about 151 okay. and if you look on this sheet that I point something million yeah and if you look on this sheet here that I've attached um, of course this is just M&O 149,942 is the M&O additional taxes increase Thank so you. is that much out of our total taxes of nine six million bucks so our total increase was up a hundred how much uh, about 151 and, and that change. includes new construction uh, yes. Mm -hmm. So with new construction, we got one hundred and fifty something thousand dollars out of six million. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's just so that the word. You just, just want to make sure the wording right. under everybody understands. That everybody understands, right? Doesn't reflect this. Reality. This essentially is collecting less than an additional one hundred thousand dollars from our current taxpayers. Mm -hmm. Total. Okay. okay. Any other questions? Mayor, I move that. Uh, uh, wait, wait, we gotta go. We have to have a public hearing, hearing first. Sorry. That's okay. That's all right. Apologize. I'm getting. All right, we're going to enter into a public hearing to discuss the tax rate. Is there anyone who would like to come and speak to the city council about the tax rate, for or against? 
Hearing and is hearing and seeing none, then I'll close the public hearing. Then I'll accept a motion. So, Mayor, I move that uh, the property tax rate be increased by an adopt by the adoption of a tax rate of 0.442 per one hundred dollars, which is effectively a one point eight seven percent increase in the tax rate. Do I have a second? Second. A motion and a second. Further discussion. See to vote. All in favor, say aye. Mayor. Oh, that's a roll call. That's exactly right. Thank you, ma'am. Place one. Place two. Aye. Place three. Aye. Place four is absent. Place five. Aye. Place six. Yes. Place seven. Aye. Place eight. Aye. And I'll vote also. We have seven, seven for and zero against. Any other discussion? Any other, nothing else on the agenda? Unless there's further discussion, then City Council meeting will stand adjourned at 541.